If you ever wanted a robot to magically write down everything that you're saying just as you say it and then stylize it? <laughs> Wieners. <laughs> you can do that here with Resolve 20. I'll show you exactly how. So let's get right into it. Here I have a video of somebody just real handsome. Let's just see what he has to say, huh? Hey guys, I'm outside surviving in the wilderness with only a coffee mug and a professional survival kit. All right, great. Now, to make this a perfect video for somebody to watch while in the bathroom, we need to put some subtitles on it. That's really easy in Resolve. We just go up to Timeline, AI Tools, Create Subtitles from Audio. And here you have some options. Let's do maybe like 12 characters per line. Looks good. And hey, maybe we'll even do double lines. Oh, baby. Let's just see how that goes. Let's hit Create. And that will put our subtitles in. Let's see how this works. Hey guys, I'm outside surviving in the wilderness with only a coffee mug and a professional survival kit. Seems like it works great. Now let's stylize these subtitles because these are real boring. There's a couple ways that we can do that. We can select a subtitle and we can go over here to our inspector. And this is where we can adjust the text and the timing and all of that stuff. But if we go up here to where it says track, right meow, then we can adjust the style of the text. So we could change to a different font. I like popping semi bold. We can make it all caps. We can add drop shadows. We can do all kinds of stuff to this. There's actually quite a bit of customization that we can do to all of these subtitles at once. But in Resolve 20, they just came out with animated subtitles. So if we go up to our effects panel and under our titles, under subtitles, there is a folder that says animated. And these are some presets that you can drag onto your subtitle track and have it animate. So let's just try one out. How about Lollipop? Let's drag this onto the track header of subtitle one. Bloop, like that. And now... Hey guys, I'm outside surviving in the wilderness with only a coffee mug and a professional survival kit. All right. So this is animating each word on and it looks cool, but it's too small and there's a bunch of stuff wrong with it. So we can go to our inspector, to our track, and we have this effect that's applied to the track and we can adjust things like the animation speed. Let's take this down like that, which animates it on faster. That works pretty well. Let's also adjust the size. Maybe we'll make that a little bigger. And depending on the preset that you use, there'll be various different options here. And that works pretty well. And I can still kind of go in and adjust the colors and everything. Let's make this kind of darker like that. Customize this for what I want to do. And I can also just grab a different template here, like word highlight and drag that down onto subtitle one. And that's going to give me a different style here. This, let's take the size up a little bit. Let's change our font and we'll make the text white and the highlight kind of a yellow, make this a little bit bolder. And we'll even add a little background so we can highlight it with the background. Actually, let's, yeah, let's make this background kind of yellow like that. We'll take the highlight color and make that white. So we're just going to highlight behind it and we can adjust the width and the offset and everything of this just to make sure this is exactly how we want it. And now it'll highlight each word. Cool, right? Let's put this more in the middle. Great. Maybe we'll take this word spacing up a little bit. There we go. All right. And we could also write on the words, which will highlight them as they're writing on. I think I'll take that right off, off. Actually, I like it this way. Let's try this one. Let's try statement. Let's see what this is doing. There we go. That's kind of what we were doing, actually. Take that size up a little bit. Make the animation speed up a little bit. There we go. Now we're ready for the socials. <laughs> So yeah, pretty easy way to make customized animated subtitles for your videos in Resolve. It's a cool way to get little motion graphics going, spice things up a little bit. Speaking of spicing things up, we have a free motion graphics video course, which it's available right there or in the description down below. It's called Amazing Motion Graphics in Five Minutes or Less, and it teaches you some really cool techniques on how to make some flashy motion graphics for your videos. Diving into the Fusion page a little bit, but don't worry, even if you don't know Fusion, you can follow along, learn some really cool stuff, and have uh, some tools in your tool belt for the feeds. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!